11 days to school. 11 days. Hi, hey everybody. Welcome to a part of our woods that you have never seen, or part of our property you have never seen. I don't just uh, go back and record back here in the woods. I'm just, uh, you know, just back in our woods and. Uh, oh, hi, Sassy. Sassy's back in the woods too. So I'm out here clearing out the dead stuff, like the, the stuff that is no longer gonna grow just so that I can clear out the stuff that could catch on fire, you know. You know, just clean out, clean out our woods. Hi, kitty kitty. Hi, Sassy. Sassy kind of looks like Nemo, I know. Yeah. Yeah, how are you today? Sassy's like the, the friend that you talk to while you're working out in the yard and stuff. Yeah. He like walks with you to the mailbox. He comes and talks to you while clearing out the dead stuff out of the woods. Yeah, how was your day? You having a good day? Find anything good out there? Yeah, definitely. Back to my job. I know, I'm sorry. I have to, I have to get stuff done, I'm sorry. But you can come and, uh, can come and chat if you want. I'm just uh, cleaning out the, the woods a little bit so it's a little, can walk through it a little bit hopefully in the future. So my ultimate goal back here is to clean, clean it out and make it more like usable space. It's just really nice back here. I mean, it's real. I just love woods. I don't know. Maybe we can camp out here one day. Maybe we can. I don't know. It's just, it's just really cool back here. But so Braley's with Caitlin right now. Stacy's doing work on the inside. So I'm doing work out here today. Get some exercise and cut down some of this stuff. Really, really did have a hard time this morning. She expected school, so she woke up expecting to go to school. She got herself ready for school, and she was really upset when we didn't go. And, I mean, we have to remind her that, hey, school hasn't started yet. We still have a little ways away. I mean, she just really wants to go to school. And school, there's nobody at school yet. So uh, we have a plan to help her out with that. Now, I'll show you when we create it after we get some of this done. But I do need to recreate it create it today for tomorrow morning in case that happens again. It's just one of our to-do tasks for the day is to get something set up, which I'll show you a little bit later when the sun goes down for now. It's wood clearing time. a big spider web. Another purpose of cleaning out the woods a bit is uh, firewood. This provides us with firewood because we love having our fire days, fire nights or whatever. Socket saved that one. Something real quick I want to do that I've been planning on doing since I'm out here clearing woods today. Remember backyard Bambi? Well, I got something for him.
I was hoping the gold would show up a little better, but really, I have to just uh, reapply uh, the paint or do a different color. But that's good enough for now, right? I think so. That's that's perfect. Back inside now, and Braley just got home recently. She spent time with Caitlin today. Oh, hey Braley, what does your shirt say? Root. Root for each other. Yeah, relax time. You got others, other pants for her too. Well, that whole outfit she's wearing is new. This is actually a shirt that Braley picked out. <laughs> Grow your world. <laughs> Oh yeah! Is that your shirt? The one that you picked that you want to wear? She really liked the outfit of that green shirt goes with these pants. Yeah. But she refused to take certain things off and change. Yeah, that's changing's hard. Well, she like change is hard. Well, changing she just really liked, I think, the outfits too. Yeah. And She's said, getting that personal preference. Like we're seeing it a little bit more and more. All right. I mean, not a whole bunch, but. Definitely some clothing preferences we've been starting to notice. Generally, she doesn't really care what we dress her in. As I was saying earlier today, Braley really had a tough time this morning with uh, the whole school not starting thing. So we're going to make something really quick. This is something we've done kind of in the past with her countdowns. Um, maybe this will give someone an idea too. This is just what works for us, what works for Braley. Stacy sent me a picture. So I'm going to print off a picture of Braley's school. If I can find what Stacy sent me. The printing is happening. Uh, one downfall to working in the woods. Uh, ticks. Ticks are just as scary as spiders. But maybe for, for safety purposes. Ticks are actually worse than spiders. Just because of the risk of Lyme disease. We, we do know people that have gotten Lyme disease from ticks. It is not a good time. So we'll, we'll do our best to avoid that paper not set correctly. Uh, come on, printer. So for this project, all I, need, all I need is a picture, tape, scissors, construction paper. We'll start utilizing it in the morning. I just gotta make sure I finish it tonight, which I'll show you while I finish it just because, you know, maybe this is useful for somebody, somebody, some of you out there, or maybe you don't use the exact same thing. Maybe it just gives you an idea. That's very possible. On the other side of that is the photo of her school. I am obviously not going to show you the photo of her school for privacy reasons. Now, let's go get the supplies that I need to build what I'm building in our trusty supply cabinet that we built. Go into our supply cabinet to get this stuff. Remember when me and Braley built this? It was fantastic. I know we have construction paper in here. Let's just use, don't need too much. Just grab a small stack of them, you know? Small stack. Okay, now I just need some scissors and tape. Okay, head, head out to the kitchen table for this one. Set the camera on something. So, I'm just gonna cut slices. Yeah, that paper slicer would probably make this go a lot faster. So there's 11 days left until school starts. One. I think it's 12 days from today, so I'll just, I'll just put another one. If I remember right. All right, so I'm gonna make a chain. I'm gonna give this the credit for this to actually Caitlin because she did this for, I think she did this for Christmas, I wanna see. What, I don't. We used a chain before. 
I don't exactly remember what we used it for. Now, oh, I think it was for moving. I really don't remember. Hey, Stacy. What did we use the chain for last time? So pretty much the same thing? Or was it for moving? Cause we, yeah, cause we use the social story to go along with it. So yeah, we use the chain like this for moving with the social, social story attached to it. And it was actually something that the social story and the chain is something that Caitlin created for Braley for the move to help her with the move. And I think that was one big contributing factor to Braley's success with all those changes that came last year um, with the move, going to the school, all that, you know. Like it, was, it was a success. It was a lot of change for her. But we didn't really see any uh, negative effects because usually with the, like big changes like that, it's pretty big. But I think part of it, she just loves this new house. I don't have a social story for the countdown to school. So we're going to go with this tomorrow. Use the chain. Start the chain tomorrow. We'll see how that works, see if she's upset still. I mean, if, if she's still having a hard time, uh, I'll make the social story tomorrow. But we'll see how this works because she does understand a lot of what we're saying. So I think explain to her, she'll be going to school in, in this many days. I think it's gonna help because visual representation, she's a visual learner. She understands things visually over anything else, so. This should help, and I hope this gives you all some ideas too. Like attaching a social story story to a countdown, it works. Here we go. Perfect. Look at that. Chains made. So I'm gonna keep this in the office just so that uh, no animals get to it, and really doesn't. Uh, make days go faster than they should. We'll show you in the morning. It's exciting, right? Yeah, sorry today wasn't too eventful. Not a lot happening this week. As, as you noticed, our videos are not that exciting right now, especially without me. Awesome things we've done over the last few weeks or months. It's been really chill. We're, we haven't been doing too much. It's the time of the year where it's just, we're, we're at the transition from no school to school. Getting stuff done around the house. Not exciting tasks. I mean, I did get out in the woods today. That was a fun task, but you know how it goes. There's just times of the year where it's just days just mashed together. And But I do have to stay. Still getting stuff done. Still making things happen. Still making videos, right? We are going to make this an epic fall. September and October are still going to be exciting months, even with school starting. I'm excited. Stuff to look forward to and stuff to work towards too. Keeps me going. And as always, thanks for watching our videos. And thank you so much for watching, subscribing, liking, all that good stuff. Have a good day. Night. School. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Wow. I might have done too many days. <laughs> oh, 12. 12 days. Really? Take we're one, one day off? closer. You Take it? one off. Yep. I'm going to get your scissors. You want scissors? One day closer. Yep. Eleven days to school. Eleven days. We can't okay. cut more than one one day. Every morning, we're gonna cut one of these, okay? Cut. Yep. Because every one is a is a wake up. First day, she may not be like into it, get it, everything, but 
I don't know, if, as we start doing it every morning, it becomes routine. I think that as the days go by, it's it, it just makes more sense, you know, type thing. So, so yeah, that's that's the activity we do, and it it works. I mean, today, Bradley definitely woke up in a better mood already than she did yesterday. She's not like getting ready for school and stuff like that already, so it could have been just a one day thing. But it does not hurt to have this process. It's, not hard to make, doesn't take much time, and she likes cutting things with her scissors, so if anything, it's just a fun activity she can do every morning. Look forward to. What if we did a 365 day one? That would be fun. Have a great day.